was a drug made for me to host me, make her cry at some beat. She was the fastest job out there, she could take me about anywhere. I finally arrive at Great Cable Island and we anchor at Long Beach in the southern side of the island to shelter from the northerly. There you go. You can see small squiddies there, bigger squiddies down there, the bridle. You can see actually Asta shadows on the sand. It's me over there. Hello. It's four meters deep. And you see every ripple of the sand. How beautiful is that? Yeah. Every ripple of the sand. And the beauty squids. And a uh, of squid for lunch or breakfast, but they're a bit, a bit small. We decided to go exploring the abandoned resorts and as you can see it's a very poor state. It's been uh, vandalized and uh, there are lots of rubbish and a lot of work for whoever will size the resort. However, we had a lot of uh, adventure and amusement looking at all the parts of the building, uh, being careful of not touching anything and not adding to the destruction you could see um, as we don't have any interest to vandalize. Um, it was very, uh, very interesting. There's still some toilet paper here for people who want to use it. And TP, Tipsy, Ben and I had a very good time at what used to be the Contiki Resort. So, um, although it's uh, not supposed, op supposedly open to uh, tourists, um, we didn't see anyone and uh, we kept a low profile doing it, not disturbing anything. Um, it's amazing to see how nature can reclaim a place so fast and we can imagine how beautiful it used to be uh, back in the days and how fun it would have been to go cooling yourself in that swimming pool so i like it. it's a little bit of a zombie apocalyptic or apocalypta world adventure for uh, benny and i the next day we decide to go exploring the island and do some spear fishing and snorkeling with a uh, pen fast dinghy I think Tipsy is really uh, the one that's having the best time. Uh, she enjoys all the activity and the beach and uh, often look around us, uh, watch for us when we go swimming. Um, she's the best uh, dog ever. Southern Capel Island is very beautiful, like the rest of the islands. Um, there are a lot of uh, very small beach, very clear water, and the coral is uh, regen regenerating. So, I really recommend anyone to have a good stop as one of my favorite places on the Queensland coast. And uh, in case you wonder, Tipsy is named Tipsy because she's very good at making the kayak tip. Um, yes, and beautiful sunset from the top of the island. Next day we set up and we uh, stop in Pearl Bay that you can uh, you can see a little video there and try your luck at fishing and um, we've not much luck but Pearl Bay remains one of my favorite place, place on the Queensland coast too. It's weird I don't feel like fishing I like a fish but I don't feel like fishing. No I don't think these. Piece of a fish. Oh. Just passing a uh, Port Clinton and uh, yeah, came from Capel. Um, 
It's about like 3 or 4 p.m. now. And uh, got a nice southerly setup, like nice 12, 12 knots breeze. Uh, I'm pulling Benny. We're supposed to anchor at Port Clinton, but he decided to, uh, I think, to go to Island at Creek. Do you know the other six or ten miles, so it's plenty of time, so it should be alright. But a uh, little tipsy dog, she really wanted to stop. Oh my god, she really wanted to stop. She's so tired. She had no, no run on the beach today. Uh, I'm just with the kite, so nothing else. No mine? Nothing? Just the kite? Uh, and I'm sitting on 10 knots. Yeah. Um, so it's easy, it's all good angle. When I want to drop the kite, I just get rid of the sheet to the suck up. Um, yeah. So good. Little tipsy dog really wants to go, I think, to stretch her leg, but. Oh, you feeling, sweetie? Uncle Benny abandoned you, eh? Oh, oh, yay! Anyway, I gotta take care of uh, the boat, and uh, I should be anchoring in Islanded Creek. Well, stopping in Islanded Creek anyway, um, about an hour and a half or something. So it's easy. Cheers, bye. Finally arrived at Highlanded Creek. This is my favorite place and we had the best time fishing and exploring around with the puppy. Um, not too much luck unfortunately with the fish. I think we were cursed. And um, yes, the best the best time before going out. Here is some exploring we do with the dinghy everywhere, which is good when we are sailing in company. Uh, basically I don't have to use my dinghy or my kayak, so I would like to thank Ben from Inara for that. Ah, it's very appreciated. Oh, secret, secret, secret cave. And as always, hasta la vista.